Okay, let's take a closer look at the smart gate and our toolbar at the side. So you'll notice that you've got the little arrow there and we can make it bigger or smaller. I'm just gonna take a look at this toolkit right here. So if we take, click on the little toolkit, it will open up at the top. Now in the toolkit, you have several options. The first of which is your camera. If you click on the camera option, you will have all your camera tools. The very same as we do up at the top of the board in the toolbar at the top. Um, if you click on the A, you will have all of your text features. So this is the text pen. So again, if you were writing, you would be able to edit your writing right here. Finally, you have the stamp, and this is a new feature. Um, the stamp pad works as um, just like this. So if I click on whichever stamp I would want, I click on my board and I am making that stamp. Okay, so um, you can make happy faces, sad faces. The standard stamps are all there. If you would like to add a custom stamp, um, like I have here with some emoticons, you hit the little plus sign and you go find the picture that you would like to add. So maybe I want to make um, this uh, custom stamp, click on it, hit open, and it becomes a custom stamp. Not a very good one, but now I have this as one of my stamps. It's kind of terrible. Um, so that's the stamp pad option. The last thing that I want to show you is the favorites, and that is the star. You are um, given, I think it's five favorites that you can have, and they will show up even when you close your little toolbar here at the side. The little arrow that is right here will allow you to close your toolbar. So if I click on that, it will close. And these are your favorites. So when I click it, you can customize these favorites. So I've added a sort of a turquoise pen, a highlighter, and a black pen. So those are available to me all the time, even when it's closed. So I can just click on that, and I have my turquoise, whoops, click on this, and I have my turquoise pen. So anytime I want, I have turquoise, I have a highlighter, and I have my black pen. Now, if I wanted to add some new custom features there, I would click on the star, and I would hit the plus, and I can pick whatever I want it to be. If I want it to be the text pen, do I want it to be a green pen that perhaps is fatter and maybe it ends in an arrow. So now every time I am using that pen, add as a favorite, if I click on my green arrow pen, oops, sorry, click on my green arrow pen and I need to write, so now I made that green arrow pen. Okay, so that is how you customize your favorites and use the stamp pad in the new Smart Ink.